Greetings once again, Palward enthusiasts. As our journey in this captivating game unfolds, the wonders never cease. I'm happy to unveil five more game-changing tips and tricks, some generously shared by our fantastic community members to elevate your Palworld adventure. Number one, perfect incubation zones. Upon reaching level seven and triumphing over a world boss, you can unlock and construct the egg incubator. Here's a pro tip. Different species of eggs may have varied incubation percentage bonuses. Optimize your hatching process by setting up two incubators, one close to heat and another in a colder environment. Switching eggs between incubators ensures the coziest spot for efficient hatching. Number two, egg hatching speed hack. After numerous daring expeditions, I found myself with a surplus of eggs, each with its own hatching time. Huge eggs, in particular, took a considerable two hours to hatch. To expedite the process without building additional incubators, open your world settings before logging in. Adjusting the incubation time lets you enjoy the fruits of your labor more efficiently. Number three, stamina management. Craft saddles for your pals to ride and explore Palworld with ease. However, special moves consume stamina. Thanks to a community tip from TannerGlen4508, if you accidentally exhaust your pal's stamina, dismounting and hopping back greatly accelerates the recovery process. For flying pals, pop your glider and get back in the saddle midair. Number four. Tactical repositioning. When facing formidable foes like world bosses, preserving your summoned pal's health is vital. Neon Virus shared a simple yet effective tactic. Resummon your pal to safety before the opponent's spell connects. This not only enhances your pal's survivability, but also allows for strategic flanking. Deploy guerrilla tactics by resummoning your pal behind your target for a tactical advantage. Number five, synergizing family skills. As I delve deeper into Palworld, I've discovered the importance of passive and active partner skills for crafting a robust party. Focus on skills like King of Fluff from Sweeper, whose stats increase with the number of Sui in your party. Experiment further by merging higher quality Sui using the PAL Essence Condenser at level 14. A similar approach applies to Elizabeth, whose Queen Bee Command skill enhances her stats, with more enlisted Bee Guard in your party. Share your hidden gems and tips in the comments. Your wisdom could feature in our upcoming videos. If you've relished these insights, don't forget to like and subscribe. Your support fuels our journey. Until our next Palward escapade, take care, stay safe, and I'll catch you in the next installment.